Hello, water signs. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Tisa. So awesome to have you guys here. I'm here right now looking into April the 12th through the 14th of 2024. Now, everything that you need to know about me, it is right down below and it is in our description box. All right. Thank you for your love and your support. All right. On this channel, I go and find a secret of energy that's hidden and I bring it to light here. So let's see what kind of energy we have right here. This is water signs. This is Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. The weekend message, April the 12th through the 14th, 2024. What is this energy check? The Nine of Pentacles, okay? This could represent a Virgo. This could be somebody here that is single. Maybe somebody here is self-reliance. This could represent um, living a life full of luxury in some type of way. So let's see what else we get right here, okay? This is water signs. It's Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. April the 12th through the 14th of 2024. Yeah, I'm getting a Virgo. This card is Virgo right here. And this card right here is Virgo. Okay. Now, Magician. Okay. Self-reliant manifesting. Okay, so I feel like you're manifesting something right here by yourself. Could be the case. Okay. Maybe that takes a lot of discipline. I get the sense. Yeah, I feel like it right here because this right here says discipline. So I feel like right here, you're manifesting something right here, I feel. But I just feel like it takes discipline because you know you're self-reliant. I feel like you know you don't have anybody else to depend on. If that's your story right here for whoever could be watching this, that part is resonating. But I'm here for some people here. Somebody know I have nobody else to count on in some way so i'm gonna be disciplined right here i'm gonna be abundant because i'm self-reliant okay that's what i feel right here self-reliance okay and maybe you could have learned this early on but i feel like right here somebody here is self-reliant right here okay and they manifest because i feel like somebody feel like i'm sitting here when the ducks all you know go into the road it's the fact that you made it happen or when the ducks all go down the road, who gonna be there to help me? Something like that, right? Could be a Virgo or a Gemini or you, something like that, right? What's the message right here, please? The Emperor. Now this card right here could be Aries or a father right here. Okay. Divine masculine right here. I'm hearing call me king. Okay, wow. So I'm not sure if you're a woman or a man, okay? But I'm here with somebody say, call me king. Okay, right here, what do you see? Call me king. Right here, something like that. Now, you know, another way I could get what call me king could be that you're self-reliant and now somebody wants you to call them the king. You know, that's what, that's what it could be too, okay? So it's like, how am I going to get you to call me the king? Something like that. Okay, let me see. What's the message right here, please? Okay, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Yeah, I'm hearing high vibes or highly intuitive. Nothing wrongs. So this one right here feels like somebody is spying on you. I got my eyes on you. Okay, I feel like somebody does. Somebody had an eye on you. Could be at a distance or maybe you can't see them. Something like that here. So I'm getting like this Aries have their eye on you or the Virgo or the Gemini. Just pray. Okay. All right. And I'm getting like they're fixed, I feel. Right here it says fixed, but it also just say mutable. Hmm. Okay. So maybe somebody's fixed and then somebody else wants you to change or something like that. Okay. Hmm. Seven of Swords flipped over my hand in reverse. You're seeing it right there. Seven of Swords reverse is getting caught. Okay. So somebody could get caught right here. Okay, maybe this Virgo is getting caught and for some way, for some people here. The Virgo is getting caught, I feel, right here for some people, right? Or something like that. Now, anything said here could be you or them, okay? So, the Virgo could get caught or you could get caught, okay? Page of Swords, I told you somebody's spying. This is a spying card. So, I feel like somebody is spying with somebody here, I feel. Okay, did somebody catch you spying? Or something like that, right? Okay. Seven of Cups right there. So I'm hearing somebody say, I almost had them. 
in some way. So maybe somebody almost had you or you almost had them. The judgment reverse, but I feel like somebody got caught right here, cheating and lying right here, or spying, or lusting. This card could be lusting or having a one night stand. Something like that, okay? Seven of Swords over here reverse and the Nine of Pentacles. Somebody's caught. They're getting caught here, okay? Yeah, they're getting caught. Okay. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles right there. Okay. I feel like somebody got caught in the past already. You know, the past could be one minute ago, you know? So, somebody could have got caught in the past one minute ago or any time in the past, right? I feel like they didn't. Okay. Now, the Ace of Pentacles. Stable new beginning. I feel like, okay, so somebody could got caught in the past and now you have a new beginning. Well, somebody here wants to come back to you, all right? But I feel like they got caught in the past about something, right? All right? Like I said, self-reliant. Maybe you started something new in some way, okay? I feel like somebody here over here is... Um, yeah. They, they depend on themselves. I'm getting right here. Like, they're, they're self-reliant over here. Okay, they could start anew in some way and it'd be like winning a lottery for them or for you or whoever, right? All right, but I just feel like somebody got caught in the pants in some way. Okay, yeah, two of swords, all right? Maybe somebody didn't know they got caught in the pants right here, right? Or somebody wasn't open up to you. There was been a stalemate to you in the pants. Could be the case here, right? They got caught about that. Somebody know there was a stalemate, or they was avoiding them, or they wasn't really into them, something like that. Somebody can know that, okay? But I'm hearing like you make new beginnings feel like winning the lottery or something like that. I feel like something that you do right here is like you make it just be like winning the lottery or like a new foundation or new prosperity. Yeah, I feel like when you make a decision to earn more money or something like that you just do it and you're like you do that okay when you get focused about something right here you're going to do it i feel right here okay these cards right here gemini and virgo okay the magician gemini and virgo could be a gemini or virgo here now a magician is somebody here that is manifesting something i feel okay and that's the truth. I feel like somebody could be spying on you. Maybe somebody here is spying on you. Or maybe somebody here is consciously aware, okay, about love. Or if somebody here is involved or, you know, into something here in a love situation or not. Something like that, I feel. If somebody's a stalemate or something here is illusion, something like that. They might know something like that, I feel. Okay, what's really going on with a Gemini or whoever else, right? Or maybe the lover's card right here in the two of swords sexually right here. Somebody's not attracted could be the case that's sex right there this one right here maybe they're not attracted sexually could be the case maybe somebody know that that could be the case for some people here king of pentacles right here okay so this could be about a husband this could be about work or money okay i'm hearing like call me king look at the king of pentacles so i'm getting like your financial secured here something like that all right, or some of you, you know the truth about a husband right here. Now, this husband could be spying on you for some people. So, I feel like somebody's having anxiety. I'm gonna like somebody that got caught before, they have anxiety now. I feel right here, okay? Yeah, okay. What else is going on here? Yeah, page of wands right here. The page of wands is really good news. The page of wands can represent being curious right here about something. So I feel like somebody spying on you from the past, they're curious about you, okay? They want you to call them the king. I'm getting right here. Yeah, they, I guess what I'm getting, somebody want possession, okay? That's the, they're possessive right here, or they're controlling or something like that, I'm getting right here. They want you to call them the king. I feel like over here, like, you're self-reliant, though, in some way. So, they're wondering, like, how do they fit in since you rely on yourself or something like that. And they got caught before, and they want you to call them the king. Something like that. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm here like I want to be your king. Okay, so that's how I feel right here. This is this is all the truth right here. It's a sports when to come out. It's clarity and truth. So I feel like they got caught before. They want to be your king, right? Or or they're possessive and controlling, and they want you to call them the king. So go right there. Okay, so seven of cups right here in the emperor. That's how I feel, they're controlling. Even this card right here could be controlling or like stability or order, okay? And the seven of cups right here could be like looking at multiple options or this could be, once again, spying. I feel like somebody's spying hard, I feel. Okay, I'm getting the Aries right here. Whoever else is spying hard, I feel right here. Right. Or if somebody got caught, they was thinking over here that you would still see them as the king or whatever else. Or I feel like that's what they want, I feel. Yeah. Yeah. The strength part right here. I feel like that's a challenge for you, okay? Maybe you have Leo or Virgo in your chart, or this is a Leo or Virgo, but I'm getting right here with a strength card. Somebody, that could be a challenge. A strength card is somebody that's very powerful, you know, very courageous, or something like that. Here, here. Or see how the, this one right here is looking backwards, right? The way that I have it over here, it's like it's looking way back over here to how somebody got caught in some way, right? So that's the way the strength card is looking this way, how they got caught over here. So they got caught this way, I feel. Right, or if somebody's possessive or they're controlling. It even could be like, okay, I don't know, because this sometimes I look at this one even as submission. So maybe somebody wants you to be submissive to them. But it's like they got caught though, or something like that. So some type of way they got caught. So I feel like that's a challenge then, you know, to get you to be submissive to them since they already got caught on something. Something like that. Because do you feel like somebody won't be controlling here? So I feel like, you know, Dom and Sub energy could be the case, BDSM, something like that. Especially with the Emperor here. It's controlling, okay? And this one over here is also controlling. So I feel like somebody wants to control you, okay? Or they want, you you know, they want to be your Dom or whatever, okay? Submissive or whatever. And I feel like right here, it could be wishful thinking though because either, they got, I feel like they got caught in some way over here. They got caught over there in some way, okay? So, you know, somebody just keep looking back to whatever they got caught about right there, I feel, you know. Okay, yeah, I feel like they're depressed over here because they got caught before, right? And they just want you to see them as the king or, you know, or whatever else, the queen or whatever. But I'm getting the king, so I'm going to just say the king. Okay, it's just what I'm feeling like, okay? Now, here's another thing. Somebody doesn't want you to be seen, too. I'm getting too. It's like cover up or something like that. Okay, because the hermit right here and this one, your inner strength is real strong. And the hermit card reverse could be coming out of the, the closet, coming out of the dark, coming out of not being seen. Now I'm seen right here like the sun, right? Shining bright. I'm seen in some way. So maybe somebody here didn't want you to be seen. But they got caught already. So it's like somebody here could be really embracing their sexual energy in some way. Whatever was hidden, maybe that's coming to light now in some way. You know, whatever right here that somebody here didn't know about sex or didn't touch that part of sex within themselves. I feel like they embrace their sexuality now here, right? So somebody wants you to control that, I feel, for some people here. Or they want to control it, something like that. Because they're very possessive, I feel. They, they really are, I feel. Ten of Pentacles are right here in the sun card. I'm getting a Leo. I knew that. I feel like you're shining bright right here. Yeah. Okay. So you're shining really bright here, I feel. You know? And a Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Because I'm hearing like I just want to control. Okay. So somebody is obsessed with control of it and not only do they want to control something about what you have on or whatever or sex or whatever they also want to control money i feel like somebody wants full control right here right but i feel like they got caught before so it's like how are they going to get control or something right here right so kind of feel right because ten of pentacles reverse so ten of pentacles reverse could be losing a family or losing money it could definitely be losing it all it, you know it really can okay and somebody could be depressed right here because, the, you know, maybe they was into BDSM with somebody else or they want you to do this or whatever. 
to be the case. But I feel like somebody felt like they lost it all, or they lost the Leo right here, or the Virgo, or somebody, the Aries, or you, you know? What's the message here? I'm just saying water signs. I don't have any cards right here that's the water sign. Like, you're missing or something like that. I don't have the Queen of Cups, the King of Cups, and then like that here. I feel like you're missing here, okay? It's wishful thinking you could be missing or something like that. Okay? Somebody's depressed because they missed it or they wasn't here or something like that. Because the Two of Swords right here and the Seven of Swords reverse is a stalemate, okay? It's avoiding something right here. They got caught. They're not even here. Something like that. Okay, water signs, you're not here. I don't have any card here for the water signs, okay? So, I feel like, you know, somebody could have had big plans for something, but I feel like you're not here or they're not here. Something like that. This is also controlling. Influence right here, two of wands, right? So, I feel like, you know, somebody wanted to control you or whatever, but they how when they're not even here. I feel like they're not even here for some people right here. Yeah. So I just feel like they're just sitting here lusting or they're just sitting here spying, but they're not here. Maybe they thought that you wasn't going to know that. Could be the case. The judgment card reverse. Or maybe they thought that you wouldn't sacrifice something right here. Okay. What's the message right here, please? A knight of wands and a judgment card reverse. Seven of wands here. Yeah, so I feel like, you know, this could have been a big mind game or whatever. Because I feel like you're not here. I don't see any water signs cards here, okay? So maybe they was in a fantasy by themselves, could be the case. And I just feel like somebody didn't want you to wake up from the fantasy right here. I feel like, but it's a challenge though right here because they got caught because they slipped up and had a one night stand. And they're not even here. Or maybe somebody was waiting for somebody or something like that. So let's say somebody was waiting for you. You're not here. And then they went off to have a one-night stand, right? Okay, well, somebody know they're definitely not coming here then. Since they had a one-night stand somewhere else and you're waiting for them. Could be the case. Okay, what's the night of wands right here in the judgment reverse? Yeah, the fool. So I feel like somebody, you know... It was unexpected to them to get caught or something they did impulsively. They definitely got caught at that, I feel. You know, I feel like it's simple. You're not here anywhere, okay? Somebody said regret because you're not here right now, in a sense. Okay? So, like I said, you never showed up in this reading, so you're not here. It's brilliant. Okay? Somebody's in regret right here. They're not here for love or you're not or whatever. Something like that. Yeah, there's no, there's no water sign in sight I'm getting right here. I just got a devil card right here, okay? The knight of swords, the three of swords, and the two of cups. There's no water sign here in sight. Where are you? Or where's the love or something? It's like right here at the end, we get a two of cups. True love, falling in love. Maybe they fall in love after you was gone. Could be the case. And now they regret or something like that. This is what I have here. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. I send you all peace, blessings, of course, love and lights. Namaste to you.